India's third mission to the moon, Chandrayaan-3, took off successfully from the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota in Andhra Pradesh on Friday afternoon, 14th July 2023, 2:35 p.m. IST. Following the success, Prime Minister Narendra Modi took to Twitter to congratulate all involved and said that Chandrayaan-3 scripts a new chapter in India's space odyssey. The mission aims to achieve what its predecessor could not land softly on the lunar surface and explore it with the rover a successful landing will make india the fourth country after united states russia and china to achieve the feat after launching into an orbit around the earth at an altitude of 179 km on friday the spacecraft will gradually increase its orbit to escape the earth's gravity and slingshot towards the moon after reaching close to the moon the spacecraft will need to be captured by its gravity once that happens the lander which carries the rover inside it will separate from the propulsion module and start its powered descent there will be four scientific payloads on the lander to study lunar quakes thermal properties of the lunar surface changes in the plasma near the surface and a passive experiment to help accurately measure the distance between the earth and the moon the landing site of the latest mission is more or less the same as the chandrayaan 2 near the south pole of the moon at 70 degrees latitude landing on the south pole will give us a wider perspective of lunar pole volatiles and have a profound impact on the future of deep space exploration if everything goes well the chandrayaan 3 will become the world's first mission to soft land near the lunar south pole